she wasn't built to be charming. She wasn't configured to fit inside a neighborhood like her predecessor, Crosley Field. Riverfront Stadium was designed to function. A multi-purpose machine, her concrete and steel body bolted down along the Ohio River, sharing the banks with warehouses, factories, skyscrapers. She had a job to do, and she did it well. But machines don't last forever, and eventually we deem them out of date and find something shiny and new to serve our ever-changing purposes and landscapes. After 32 years, after 2,576 games, and after 64,650,533 fans walked through her turnstiles, the time had come to say goodbye. Baseball. Been to my life for 58 years now. But these past 30 years right here have been the greatest of my career. And when this place is knocked down December the 29th, those memories will not leave this area. They'll always be here. And for those of us that were lucky enough to have our breath taken away by her majestic size, our eyes widened when we first saw her expansive green field as we made our way to find our plastic seats of blue, green, yellow, or red. We are forever grateful that she let us be a part of her lifespan. We may not remember the final scores or whether the Reds won or lost, but we remember the scoreboard's glow. We can smell the damp concrete and sports service treats. We can feel the rumble in our chest as we clapped our hands and stomped our feet. She is forever with us and we will always have that stadium along the Ohio riverfront.